Hey guys, and uh, we're back on War Man here. Um, so what's what I've been saying? Hang on, I'm just turn this down here. What I've been saying: Runic potions have jumped, skyrocketed. They were like ten gold. Now they're going for like twenty-two gold. So a lot of what I do is flipping. So I buy a bunch of stuff and I'll sell it for double the price, triple the price. Um, as much as I can and it does sell amazingly people are stupid enough to not wait and they can't wait they need the items now so they go ahead and they buy the most expensive items so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna go ahead and buy all these runic potions just give me a minute Well, we've got all those running potions off the auction house. We're going to go ahead and look at Saranite. That's another one that's jumped overnight. Looking about like uh, 70 gold a stack. That's usually what they go for. Hang on, I might switch characters for this because um, Temptress is the one that does all the Saranite stuff and I can show you what, what I do with it. So we'll just collect here now quickly yeah, alright now that we've collected all that we're gonna go ahead and pretty much post it on the auction house and we'll go for a single item 30, 35 sorry for 22 gold you see that In one of my next videos, I'll probably show you uh, what happens there uh, with how much profit I make. And we're going to hop over to Temptress. Alright, now let's have a look at the auction house. And have a look here. Oh, I've got a bit of lag, hang on. <coughs> so if you see here, I've got a lot of gems in my bag that I haven't put up yet, which I can. So Autumn's Glow, so one each, 130 gold. Got a few there. If I remember correctly, I was paying 70 gold a stack. I bought about 50 stacks of those, probably more. And I'm now profiting plus 3k on that. I'd do that probably twice a day with a turnover of about 6k. So we're going to go ahead and collect that. We've still got a 69 pending there. And we'll show you in the bottom there what the, uh, the amount looks like after we collect. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and close it. We profited 2.3k. Uh, we've still got 49 still not showing, so we're going to go ahead and reload. And again, look here. We've got the Scarlet Rubies for 125 each. And a lot of the gems people buy to, uh, which I do sometimes, you turn them into other gems, but it's a lot more uh, more time consuming. I'd rather just get, get it out of the way and just post it up on the auction house and uh, just keep my 3k profit. I do this on a Horde and Alliance as well, so it's always good. So another 1.4k there, so about 5k, and we're going to go ahead and post what we have remaining on the auction house. 
Now, I thought instead of boring you to details with every single post of gems I put on, um, I pretty much just undercut them. Everything goes for about 20 gold each. I then go ahead and um, have a look at the Saranite Ore. The lowest I've seen it is about 40G, but you want to buy it around 60 to 70G. 80G is okay, but you're not going to make as massive as, as a profit. So, bear in mind uh, that. So there's 66, 66G. God, I can't even talk tonight. 66G at the moment. Um, so I've just gone and bought 82 stacks, which I'm then going to prospect down and turn them into gems and pretty much do what I've done exactly in this video. So if this video has helped you out at all, please drop a like and subscribe. Uh, comment down below if you have any questions at all, and I'll get to you as soon as I can. So thanks guys.